Hey Aries, it's Chaos from Chaos of the Divine Feminine, and this is going to be a general pop-up reading for what you have coming up this weekend. Today is Friday, um, Friday, July 23rd, so this is going to be the 23rd through the 25th. This is going to be what you have coming up this weekend. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I do have a couple of series that I would like to start working on. Um, I just need to get my subscriptions up first, my subscribers up so that I can try and avoid content stuff. I am working on some ways to protect my content. Um, anyways, so let's see what you got going on this weekend. Aries, Aries. Ascendant Masters, Angels. Can you please tell me what they got coming up this weekend? What's coming up for Aries this weekend, Spirit? What's coming up for Aries? Look like pineapple. But she tastes like pineapple. It, 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 pineapple. Aries, Aries, Aries. Isn't Ty Dolla Sign an Aries? What's Aries? April? I think Ty Dolla Sign, Ty Sign is an Aries. I think he is an Aries. I don't know. Hmm. Aries, what do you have coming up this weekend, Aries? We have this weekend coming up. I saw Queen of Wands might be dealing with a, a Leo. Ace of Cups and Ten of Cups. Okay, that be Aries. Damn. Ace of Cups, Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, an Emperor. And then we got this funky ass Ten of Swords. I see a victory. Okay. Hold on. Let's get. So tell me about this Ten of Cups. That king, that King of Wands. This is King of Wands could be dealing with Leo. King of Wands is bringing the Ten of Cups in the world. He's completing a cycle for you. Um, Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. What? So, Ten of Pentacles. We got a King of Pentacles. Somebody is walking away from a Ten of Pentacles. So you must be walking away from somebody with money and leaving them out in the cold. Because we got the ten, of sword, or the ten of Pentacles, the Five of Cups, the Five of Pentacles, the Eight of Cups, and the King of Pentacles. So you're walking away from somebody with money? Hey, money does not get, make you have a good personality. Money does not make you non-toxic. Okay, so this Ace of Cups is a lover. It, it, you got a love offer coming in from a soulmate. Lovers, please, fear. Let me find a lovers, please, fear. That's why. Okay. Someone. This is someone that you don't want to let go of. Someone that either you don't want to let them go or they're not letting you go. Because we got the, uh, the six of swords in reverse. Six of swords in reverse. Hanged man. Yeah, somebody got a new perspective. Somebody is realizing who the fuck you are, Aries. And we got the two of cups. This is a soulmate. So you're walking away from somebody with money to stay with your soulmate, which is this king of wands, this Leo energy, this fire sign, this person that completes you. Because we got the world card. He has the ten of cups and the world card. The ace of cups. This, aww. Yeah, the, you walking away from it, like, you're not taking the offer. You're leaving one offer to see joy in another offer. Oh, I like this. Okay, let's get some love messages. Wait, which one should I use? Which deck? Which deck, spirit? Which deck? Which deck should I use? This one, okay. This Ten of Swords is still sitting here, though, with this Emperor. I feel like that Emperor, so it could be an Aries. 
that you're leaving behind for a fire sign. Well, uh, Aries is a fire sign. Aries. That's also to be your energy. What Aries got going on? What messages do you have for Aries? What messages do you have for Aries? Aries. Y'all have the best read so far. What messages do you have for Aries? Worth waiting for. Engagement. Y'all might be getting engaged this weekend. I feel like whoever this King of Wands is, they're coming with it. Past life relationship. You've known this love before. This could be the one. And forgiving and learning. As you release and heal from the past, you experience. So, and that landed on this Ten of Swords. So, you're letting go. Once you let go of this betrayal from this Aries or this Taurus, this Earth sign. Once you let go of this hurt and betrayal that this Earth sign, this wealthy Earth sign, this Earth sign might have money. That's all I see is this earth sign got money. So once you let go of the pain and the betrayal from this, this this king of wands is coming in. This king of wands is coming in. And they are going to make a solid offer. Like, I'm telling you, we got the world card, the ten of cups, the ace of cups, the lovers, the six of wands, the six of swords in reverse. The hangman and the the love or the two of cups, the two of cups and the lovers. This person is not letting you go. This is your soulmate. Your soulmate is coming for you, Aries. You got a soulmate coming. I don't even think you need any angel messages, any advice. This is damn. This reading is short. I don't want it. I want to go ahead and end it because I don't want it to end on nothing bad. What uh, what what messages do you have? For um, Aries, angels, what message do you have for Aries, angels? Perfect timing, reconsider, and recovery in the near future. So, I feel like this person that is your soulmate, you, you've dealt with them before, you know them. So, you're going to reconsider. You probably thought of letting them go in the past, and this, this is going to be the the romantic gesture of a lifetime okay i see something good happening you're letting go of the bad and bringing in some new love well not necessarily new love let's see yeah you got you got you got love coming in you got love coming in oh that is a good reading i sorry y'all my fingernail broke like I ripped my nail off, so when I went and got my nails done, I'm like, don't do, only do nine fingers. Anyway, um, the reading is short. Let me, let me get some more love messages. Let's, I want to, let's let the little, uh, the, the king of wands, this, whoever this is that you have coming towards you, let's let them woo you a little bit. Let's let them woo you with some little cute love messages. What does the person, this person, this soulmate have to say to my Aries? What does this soulmate have to say to Aries? What does the soulmate have to say to Aries? And this is my deck that I made. Air sign. This is forever. 
It's always been you. You set my body on fire. Fallen by Seven Streeter. Listen to that song. That's a freaky ass. That's 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 a good song. Listen, Fallen by Seven Streeter featuring Ty Dolla Sign. Listen to that song. Um, divine pairing. This is a divine pairing. And that that Fallen song actually goes good with that that uh, Six of Swords in reverse. That not letting you go. Listen to that song. I want you in the worst way. I need you. Let's be, uh, let me be your support system. Happy home. Come on by Janae Aiko. That's enough. Listen to that. She talked about, I love when you shoot up the club. Let's go half on us, son. How, much, how far do you want to go? Yes. Yeah. End all be all. Listen to that song too. But uh, end all be all. Like a drug by Ty Dolla Sign and Feel by Post Malone featuring Kaylani. You're dealing with a divine masculine. Y'all might be getting pregnant this weekend. Uh, Y'all getting pregnant this weekend. Pregnant and Telly Telly by Telly Telly by Tusi. Listen to that song. He said uh, something about. Uh, meet up at the telly telly something something put a baby up in her belly belly That popped out right after pregnant y'all get y'all y'all might meet up and do a little thing at the at a motel this weekend at the telly telly and get preggy preggy Anyways, okay, that's all I got for y'all today Aries that that was a really good read. Oh my goodness. That was that was good I like that. Okay, so y'all got a nice romantic weekend